Hey everybody, it's Tuesday, September 1st, 2009, and you're watching the Every Girl Blog Vlog. So first of all, big apology for not having a video up last week. Um, it's a really complicated, weird story where my mom thought I'd been on the computer too much and told me I couldn't go on anymore. La 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 la. So I just couldn't get on to make it and I feel bad and I'm very sorry. So anyway, there's lots to talk about, mostly TV news. Number one, Project Runway has returned. It's a good season. I think the designers have a lot of uh, talent this year. And, like they seem to be more professionally trained. Like they know what all kinds of crazy sewing things are. So Project Runway is good. Also, Tool Academy premiered on Sunday. I think my favorite part about Tool Academy is that not only is there like funny stuff and you know people acting like idiots, but it actually seems to like have some effect on their lives at the end of it. Like. I think it actually does change people and make them realize that being a tool is not the coolest thing. So I'm really looking forward to this season of Tool Academy, and you can check that out on Sundays at 9. I read James Potter and the Hall of Elders Crossing, which is a fanfic that uh, Relin wrote an article about, which you can check out, which was actually really good, and that's the reason I read it. And it was okay. It was a really interesting story, and I liked how developed his plot was, like he actually had a whole plot, but I think his characters could have been developed a little bit better, and I mean the writing was, it was okay. I really liked the story, it was a good story, and I give it probably like 7 stars out of 10, It's my final verdict. So let's see, on Evergirl blog. Oh my gosh, Kayla has this recipe for Kahlua chocolate cake, which sounds absolutely magnificent, and I wish I could try it. If she could send me some, that'd be really cool. Relan's article about uh, James Potter series fanfics, and I did a thing about how to audition for a play, so if you ever need to audition for a play and you need some tips or anything, check that out because it's got everything you'll ever need. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, that's about it from me. Check out all the links, and, you know, follow me on Twitter, because I have to say I'm a pretty awesome tweeter. So, twitter.com slash arielfab, check it out. I want to have 300 followers by the end of September. That is my goal, to be up to 300, so please make that come true for me. Thanks. So, apparently, I haven't been watching people's vlogs lately because I watched them this morning and I'm supposed to be whistling. It's like 10 in the morning here and I'm sitting on my bed and I'm still in my pajamas, but just for you guys, I'm gonna whistle. <laughs> so you have to excuse the fact that I look completely disgusting. Oh, I know. Okay, this is in honor of Katie, which should give you a clue as to what genre of music I am singing. Whistling. What genre of music I'm whistling. That was a chorus of a certain song, which I'm sure Katie will know. I don't know if the rest of you will know it, but I hope you do. So that's all. There you go. I whistled. Yay! Um, I'll see you all next Tuesday! XOXO, Ariel. Oh, and by the way, um, congratulations to Ashley and Rach on their first week of college moving in this yay that is super exciting and i'm really proud of you guys for rocking out and also to katie and kayla and um relin and uh, 
yeah, Relin. I almost called you Michelle. And everybody who is back in school, I hope you're enjoying your homework and your classes and, you know, not being able to have a life anymore. Tear. And I am looking forward to joining you all in a month. <laughs> yeah. So, bye.